What's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Zuggle972, back here, and I'm with Misunderstood. How are you? We just finished uh, Phantom Train. We just saw the departure of Elaine and Owain, uh, Cyan's uh, son and uh, his uh, wife. Such a tragedy. Yeah, so, and we have to jump off into the belt. So we're just going to take off right into the shit. Here we go. Whee! we got to go to the belt. Uh-oh. And we're going to be fighting off a bunch of piranhas. While falling. Yeah, while f yeah. How, how do you not, uh... <laughs> First off, fuck piranhas, okay? Yeah. Bunch of cannibals, man, they really are. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Start this next round with the Quadra Slam. Now, you're gonna fight a lot of these. You're gonna, I believe, like, four rounds of uh, piranhas, and eventually you're gonna fight off a little boss named Rizopas. I believe that's what they call them. I'm trying to picture... them actually falling, and then the, and then the monsters coming out of nowhere. Oh yeah, I know, right? But that's the beauty of you know the super, you know, old school Super Nintendo, you know, uh, games as well. You just you have to have a really big imagination whenever you play these games, though. Yes. God knows, I know I did. Let's see, finish these off. Make sushi out of you. Matter of fact, piranha sushi is actually very good. Yeah, uh, we we are super big sushi fanatics. Oh damn it! Okay. All right, well. Yeah, uh, speaking of sushi, though, man, I gotta tell you right now, I've actually had a uh, piranha sushi before, and um, I can tell you this though, it's if prepared correctly, though, it can be just a, a slightly jerky, but at the same time, though, just if it's marinated correctly, man, uh, piranha sushi can be delicious. I believe you, I believe that uh, you can actually, I, I believe if you can eat piranha, if I oh, you know what, I'm, I could be wrong. I think I was talking about uh, what was it? Oh, it's at the t it's at the tip of my tongue right now. I'm not saying pufferfish, not uni. Not uni or anything, or not uh, fugu. Yeah, a blowfish is a, is a fugu. Uh, uni is sea urchin. Yeah, sea urchin. Yes. Which is delicious, by the way. We, which we uh, tried recently, though, uh, a couple of weeks ago. Oh my goodness, the most delicious. Uh, and they say it's supposed to be the ultimate acquired taste, though. But I can tell you right now, there's nothing acquired about it, though, because it was so delicious. Yeah, it was really delicious. We went to see. Uh, we went to a concert. Uh, which concert was it? It was a. Uh, it was non point, yeah. By the way, great band live. Yes, and uh, we, we both were drunk and we were hungry, so we went uh, We went down the street to Deep Sushi. Yeah, that was like literally 50 steps away. Yeah. What's going on? Oh. Oh. Down another river he goes again. Gee, what does that remind you of? <laughs> How we got here in the first place. Um. What's with the music? Guy. Looks like a child. Poor Saban. Huh. Draped in monster hides, eyes shining with intelligence, a youth surviving against all odds. His name is Gal. I remember this guy. Gal's really unique. He uses something called rage, where he gets to know every single a monster that you encounter in the belt, which eventually, you know, show back up. And you are? Huh. A little shy, are we? Yeah, the belt is a very unique place, so... Let me uh, get, let me show you an example of what I'm talking about. We need a random encounter first, though. Now, as you noticed, uh, the Whisper... Uh-huh. These uh, enemies we encountered in the uh, Phantom Train, in the uh, Phantom Forest, or the Phantom Train, if you will. Gal has the ability to learn how to fight like the beast himself. Kind of like Kimari. A little bit, yeah. He's uh, kind of like the Blue Mage, if you think about it. See, notice the Templars and the soldiers? Yeah. We fought them, uh, let's see, near Dama Castle. Mm -hmm. So why would they be here? Well, you know, aside from, you know, with the way the story's going, you would think, you know, like, why would they be here? But then again, it makes sense though, because the belt, but at the same time, it doesn't. So, um, yeah, Gal uh, learns all of his abilities uh, in the belt. Now, depending on how you utilize them, oh. whoa. Now we can't do anything with him right now. He's well, gonna... hungry. He is hungry though, but we don't have food. We just got from. We just got back from the Phantom Pain. I mean, Phantom Train. I'm sorry. 
Good game, by the way. Yes. I you love scare that. animals. Okay. I, I love that fucking game. Okay, looks like we got somebody that we're going to be recruiting. So here we are. This is Mobliz. Very nice place, by the way. Very nice, yes. Stop by the house up in the far north. The guy there is a tad psycho. He threw his kid out, thinking it was a monster. Oh, gee. This region is called the Belt. Monsters from all over the world migrate here. Ooh. Kind of reminds me of Monstro Town. <laughs> oh, I know, right? Hey, we uh, played Super Mario RPG just recently. Yes, Good. we did. What's this guy doing? He's just running around. Only carrier pigeons link our village to the outside. Okay. Um, you know what? While we're here, we should probably shop and just upgrade our uh, inventory. Yes. So don't mind me. Arsenal. Arsenal. Ooh, I'm getting two of these, though, because we've got a Genji Glove. A couple of Mithril Blades. Ooh, and for, um, yes. And if anything, I'll get two, because I'm pretty sure he'll do really good with the Genji Glove. Two Kotetsus. He is the, he is the uh, Samurai out of everybody. Okay, we're going to need a couple of Heavy Shields. We are going to need a couple of, uh... Let's see couple of bandanas, iron armor, kung fu suit, Can't go wrong with kung fu. not at all, let's see, and a magus hat, yeah, okay now for Gal, we can actually recruit uh, recruit Gal though because that's what we have to do, oh what's this, who's a poochie poochie, oh it's so cute, out hunting, I notice a kid running around with a herd of beasts. His parents know where he is? Huh. Gee. <laughs> it's kind of right? it's kind of linking together a little bit. Okay, what you're going to need is some dried meat. Now, the dried meat actually, you know, is used to recruit Gal. But what's really cool about it, though, is the fact that it, re it restores about 150 HP. Mm -hmm. And it's damn near dirt cheap, really, too. So we're going to need a little bit of them. So, okay, we got plenty. All right. Now, let's uh, get equipped real quick. Okay. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and give Cyan... Better yet. Hang on. Here, I'm going to unequip... I'm going to give him the Genji Glove. And I'm going to give Cyan the Sprint Shoes. We don't need him to protect against poison, though, but we'll still be able to sprint. So, hang on. Cover a little bit. Damn it. Hang on, let's go back to Mobiles. Somewhere. He's... Hang on, let's go back to Mobiles real quick. There's... What's this? Keep your voices down. Okay. Sorry. The soldier in here is hurt pretty bad. Some soldier wandered in here and busted up pretty bad. It doesn't look too good. Only the letters coming from the town of Miranda are keeping him going. That's what happens when you're in the wilderness. Oh. I'm from Miranda. The Empire invaded and made me join their army. I fled when I heard they were making for Donald. They caught me and did this. Now I can't even move. I'll never see Lola again. On the desk is a letter. Will you please read it? We had a cat named Lola. Yep. Russian blue. I can't get used to Imperial troopers walking the streets of Miranda, but otherwise things are okay. Flowers are blooming in the garden. Tell me, telling me spring is here. How are you doing? I'm worried. I wish I could fly to your side. Rest in the... Ooh, it's a love letter. I like to write her back, though, but I can't even pick up a pen. Oh, the poor guy. I've been that messed up before. Oh, earlier this year, though, whenever I got the flu. That was probably one of the worst feelings I'd ever had, though. I'd never had a flu that bad before. Um, I got hit with a really bad attack. Um, a mixture of allergy and an asthma attack. Yeah. Like, um, I ended up, for the first time in my life, I ended up suffering from vertigo. Yeah, it's one of the worst things ever. Yes, it is. I, I was at my job, and... All of a sudden, I was lightheaded and I was real dizzy, and I was even slurring. Yeah, vertigo does that though. It's one of the worst feelings ever. I've had it uh, once or twice though, but that was uh, mainly because I was uh, really stressed out. 
Yeah, and uh, fast forward to the next morning, I couldn't move. Oh, yeah. I couldn't even get anything to just... Wayne and Katar and Katrin are both 16 and in love. Oh, to be young and in love, that's adorable. Yeah. But yeah, fast forward, I couldn't, like, I, it's like I, the only thing I could do was like a, a half-ass sit-up. The next day, the day after that, the moment I stood up on my feet and I, I fell right back into my bed. Yeah, it's it was, one of the... It was super bad. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Never heard about the strong currents in Serpent Trench. Okay, this is important. Okay, that, that's the belt, mm -hmm. and that happens to be a cave. Those currents basically take you all the way, see there's Dama Castle, mm -hmm. all the way to, let's see, mm -hmm. I think that's, that's not South Figaro, Nikea, too bad our wa underwater breathing device was stolen. If you had a helmet that could make the Nikea, it would be good. I think that's how you pronounce it, Nikea or Nikia. Hang on. There's one more thing I need to check real quick. Another letter has arrived. Can you read it? Sure. I can't find your favorite record. I thought I'd play it, but you'd be with me, but... I'd give Lola everything if I could only move. Hang on, let's let's keep this guy's hopes going real quick. Sure, send it. Poor guy. Must be fun being the mailman. I want to get better, and I want to see Lola. I'll bet you do, buddy. I can tell. You, I mean, you can tell that she's distraught. Right now. Well, it's a he, actually. No, 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 no. His, his, his girlfriend, Lola. Oh yeah, his beloved, if you will. Yeah. Okay, hang on. Let's try this one more time. I'm pretty sure we've. Uh... There he is. Ah, there you are. There he is. Woohoo! Okay, here's what you're gonna want to do. You're gonna need to give him some dried meat. I'm pretty sure uh, we call that jerky. Ooh, I'm hungry. Dried meat. There you go. Feed it, and he shall be happy. Oh. <laughs> huh? Huh? Just batting his eyes. I haven't had a meal in a while, have you? What the? Thou art so odd. I am Cyan, and he is Sabin. You Sabin? You Cyan? Me want more food. Hey, no more food for you. You go get more for me. You're a regular munchkin. Great game, by the way. Yeah, it really is. I ain't afraid of you. You want to fight? You want to go? <sighs> me not want to hurt you. Stop looking at me like that! Oh. oh man, look at them dance, man. <laughs> look at them dance. You're pretty tough. <laughs> That's fun. You strong. It is what the? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> um, me like dancing. You good leader. Shut up! Simmer down, sirs. And thou, O wild one, who might you be? family was just... <clears throat> me understand. Me sorry. Me not mean person. Look, can't we have you two prancing around all day? Gawa, I think we're going to get along well together. Why don't you join us? Absolutely. I give you a present. Now give Sion and Sabin gift and thanks for food. <laughs> 
What matter of rub is this supposed to be? Oh. It's shiny, apparently. Okay. Can anything be that shiny? Does Mr. Thou like shiny thing? Um. Mr. Thou's that one over there. You're <laughs> a pain in the ass, aren't you? <laughs> Loopy Lock! He Batman? Maybe you try to steal my treasure. Oh, you have no idea. <laughs> That's uh, Treasure Hunter. Remember, gal, that is Treasure Hunter. Okay. Don't worry, he'll learn. I remember him. Shiny thing here. That is the, uh... Where you buy a thing in Moblitz. Cyan. That's where you stand. River brought you here. Go to Crescent Mountain. Shiny thing there. Really interesting uh, way to have somebody join you. Phew. Why do we have to invite him along anyway? Oh, God. He even walks backward, too. Mr. Thou, hurry up! We're leaving! Hey, I told you once, I am not Mr. Thou. He seems like a nymph. Oh! Oh, look, an imp! Oh, something important, too. Kappa. Here's how you build up Gal skills. Choose leap command that only appears when you're on the belt. And keep fighting on the belt and Gal will reappear. He'll have learned the attacks of the monsters that you were fighting when you leapt and returned. Ooh, I'll tell you right now, Gal is not my favorite person uh, to use in this game though, but he can be very unique. Yes, we should continue our quest. I'm not gonna... Okay, good. Don't hurt him, please. Okay, and here we are, Crescent Mountain. Oh, there... Oh, shit, look at him. What's he looking for? Look at him go, man. Huh? Hmm. That yeah, shiny thing Gal spoke of is here. Where exactly is it? Oh! Oh, come on, kid. Shall we look around? Okay, well, it looks like we gotta do some searching. Fella, isn't he? He's a uh, quite a. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Let's go looking around real quick. He's, he's alright. Basically, what we're looking for is a helmet. What's wrong? Oh, you... Oh, dear, sir. Say, but let me uh, handle this. Hey, man, money's an emotional thing, man. It really is. You know what I mean? You lose it, though, because that's uh, what you what you work for. And to lose what you work for is uh, not fun. Oh, look at that. It just popped up out of nowhere. Gow's treasure. All right, looks like glass. Looks like it just might fit, too. Is this of any use? Alrighty, we've got a... Helmet. Not just a helmet, though, but we've got quite an, uh, a trail going through us. Going towards us. Mm -hmm. Then we have to go to... Sorry. Mine's a little uh, fried from this past weekend. I just turned 30 years old, and I've been celebrating all weekend. Yes. Yeah, a lot of drinking. Lots and lots and lots of drinking. <laughs> I'm a witness. Yeah. So am I. Oh, poor guy. I think he's scared. There we go. How do three heads hit, fit into one helmet? That's what I want to know. Oh, poor kid. Oh, he, and he, he jumped. Just took a little courage. Okay, we're underwater and we're going through the uh, current. Fear Factor song, by the way. Let's see what his rages do. Right now, he's uh, pretending to be the Magitek armor. Very nice. Yeah, mimicking uh, the uh, ways of the beast. Now, in the um, in the Serpent Trench, though, there's going to be random battles left and right. So, 
we've got to be prepared. The only bad part is the only time we ever have a chance to really uh, get a chance to heal each other is when we're in battle. So, and there's also a, a random chance that you can actually, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, as you see though, those are kind of like quick time events though. And uh, you end up, you know, eventually, you know, picking up some uh, items in route there, or actually getting a rest stop, if you will. Ah, okay. It's actually pretty good. Hey, it's a Siphozo! Yeah, or uh, a jellyfish. Yeah. I'm Siphozophobic, by the way. I hate jellyfish, but I love them. Yeah, I'm terrified of uh, jellyfish. Some of them are really pretty looking, yet they're so... Yeah. I'm uh, deathly afraid of a Chironex Fleckeri. Oh, God, yeah. And the, uh, uh, the Arakanji, too. But oh, I'll... yeah, forget it. Uh, Arakanji, forget about it. Yeah, the Arakanji you can barely see, though, but it can cause... It's... It hasn't really killed very many people since the 60s, but there is something called Arakanji Syndrome. Yes. Yes, it's very, very scary. I heard a... It's very painful, too. It lasts about a week. I, I heard a... I uh, watched a story on, uh, not online, but on TV, about there was a woman who was breaking out of her shell, I guess you could say. She was kind of crying wolf, I remember. Yeah, and... She accidentally ingested one, right. That was on A Thousand Ways to Die, am I correct? Yes. Um, but she was, like, breaking out of her shell, and I think it was, like, a... A tour of students in Australia? It was like a student uh, a trip or something like that, yeah. Yeah, and this girl faked being rescued, which is something you should never do. Especially uh, in, the, in the beach, too. Yeah. Especially when it's in Australia. Yeah, because um, let's face it, though, Australia is the Texas of, uh, of, the, uh, <laughs> of the Southern Hemisphere. Yeah. But... But obviously everybody in the beach thought that was really fucked up, and I think there was a sign saying, hey, don't swim in the beach. Yeah, because they had some nets out. Yeah. Yeah, actually, correction, you don't swim outside of the nets in Australia. Yes. Not only do you, do you not do that for sharks, though, but for the uh, uh, the box jellyfish, and unfortunately what killed this girl is the uh, the Irukandji. It's basically a smaller version of the box jellyfish, but very, 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 very small and very translucent. And she accidentally swallowed. Yeah, she... Uh, Choked actually, which no. yes, if, if you ask me though, because uh, it went down her um her throat, it went down her throat, and uh, basically what happened though, she uh, couldn't breathe. Yeah. And she... I'll tell you, I'll tell you this right now though, I would have I chose I would choose death over uh, air conscious syndrome any day. Up aboard. Up aboard, we shall. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Oh yeah, must be peaceful. And. I hope that the others arrive safely. I'm sure they. I hope so too. I don't even know him, kid, but you know what? And saving scenario is complete. And when we continue on the next episode, we will see whose scenario is next. And I'll tell you right now, though Locke, Tara, Bannon, and Edgar have a lot to overcome. Peace.